Hold up, I am on my way I'm in motion Let's go to the ocean Yeah, let's go outside Good morning guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 19 and today I'm actually taking you guys to explore a place called Zlatibor which is located right here next to the beautiful city that I'm currently hanging out in called Ujitsa. Now, oh, Stanko's here. That's him right there. So let's go downstairs. We're gonna jump in the car with Stanko. First, we're heading to his house because his mom prepared us an incredible breakfast. Then we'll be making our way to Slatibor. My life is legit a mess, guys. I try so hard to like pack all my stuff the night before, but it just never worked out for me. Yeah. Let me know if you have the same problem. A brother. Good morning, bro. Good morning, man. Dude, so good to see you, man. You so, too. what's the plan for today? I just told the vlog a little something, but I want to hear what you got to say. We're going to visit the Zlatibor mountain and visit all the things that have on Zlatibor. Awesome. Even more. Awesome. And <laughs> but first, breakfast with mom. Yeah. Definitely. She made us an awesome breakfast, so I'm stoked. What's up, what my What's up, my brother? Amigo. Cause I can concentrate anytime you're beside me. Yo, we just made it to Stanko's beautiful house. Now, we've been coming here like the last two days now, and yeah. this place is awesome. It's so nicely decorated inside. I feel right at home. His mom is a beautiful, super nice woman. I'm excited to see her because last night she was actually at work while we came here for dinner. She also asked if she can be unblocked. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Mom, we're Mom, we're home. Good morning. Good morning, Mama. <laughs> How are you? Hi. 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 How are you? Hi. Hi. You've been making breakfast. Da. Mekike. 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 Nice. I'm excited to try. Oh, nice. What kind of cheeses are these? This is with pepper. With pepper. And this is with some basil. Yeah. Probably. And this is just the feta. Yeah, feta. I love that feta. And kaimak. Kaimak. You gotta have the kaimak. This is the the young, the young. Young Kaimak. And there is, we bought also to try uh, older Kaimak. Awesome. And then this is Ivar. Ivar, yeah. Ivar, guys. So, oh, this is the older right? or young. This is the older uh, Kaimak. Yeah. So you can tell it's a little bit more like cured, like a little bit more harder, kind of. Yeah. yeah. And then you got the young Kaimak, which is my favorite. And it's very, very, very fresh. There's something that's very interesting about every Serbian household. Now, Stanko's already sitting down, but I'm gonna have him get up right now. And I need you to show me the infamous cabinet that can be found in every Serbian house. Whoa. You know what cabinet I'm talking about? Uh, the Manistek? The Rakia cabinet. Uh, yeah, <laughs> the Manistek I didn't show you, or I will ever. So, actually, can you explain this for me? So these are the icons here and here yeah. and all here. Uh -huh. And this is where we put the uh, oil and a uh, little candle to fire it up as a mention of our holy man. So can be uh, uh, keeping this house safe and uh, all the so the, the saint and, the saint guards the house. Yes, and okay. then this is your slava. No, this is this my is the slava. slava. This is the main okay. man. Uh, the the main uh, holy man, uh, Saint Stefan. Okay. So this is the Saint Mother, uh, Paraskeva or Saint Petka. She was a uh, uh, mother to all. As okay. Something like that. This is from Montenegro, Saint Vasily Ostroški, uh, from uh, Ostrog monastery. Okay. Yeah, that's also from Atos. From Atos. The, yeah, Holy Land in Greece. Wow. Yes. That's super cool. And these are my grandpa and grandpa grandma. and grandma. Yeah. Now I wanted to show you guys this because this is just something that we don't see in our households too often, but it's very special and it's very special to um, the Serbs here. The Slava and the Saint is something that's very special and it protects their house and their family. Exactly. And I think it's beautiful, very beautiful. Yeah. Now what's underneath? What's in the special drawer, my friend? Oh my god. The liquor store. Now, 
if you're Serbian or you've been to the Balkans before, you know exactly what this is. And empty. you know exactly what all of those are. Yeah, this one's a bit empty, but he has several liters. And what did you tell me about every <laughs> Serbian house in Rakia? They all have Rakia. Liters of it. Liters. <laughs> and they're keeping the best Rakia for uh, the child's uh, birthdays or uh, weddings or like that. Maybe you can find Yeah, you actually 20, showed me. He Years showed old. me a um, bottle that his grandpa made, right? Your grandpa yeah. made? That was bottled in like 2003 that he's actually saving for his marriage. Exactly. And it's a very special homemade rock, yeah? And this is it right here. Yeah. The very special bottle. As you can see, there is a, a plant inside it. Uh huh. So you keep the flavor. And it says it was bottled in 2003 and he actually put candle wax over the top to preserve it. Man, I better be at the wedding, Stanko. You will be. I better be at the wedding, bro. All right, guys, time to dive on into this breakfast that um, Mama Stanko just prepared for us. Wow. Fala. Fala. Dude. Yo, guys, I'm very excited for this meal right now. There's nothing better than a home-cooked meal, and Stanko's mom is just dangerous in the kitchen. I don't know what she does in there, but it's, Absolutely crazy now. Mm -hmm. She's actually not gonna be eating with us because uh, Yeah, she just took some medication so she has to wait a while which is nice and that just makes it man even more shocking She prepared all of this for us guys now this here is the Mekike. Mekike and Man, it's so soft It has like some what's on top like is that flour and who's ready for this who's ready? Who's ready for this pool? Look at that Insane this is prosciutto. Prosciutto. Yeah. So you put prosciutto on here, or yeah, how do you everybody. typically eat the makeke? As you want. As you want. Huh? As you want. You Every want. time I ask somebody how to eat something here in Serbia, they're like, "Dude, just eat it, man. Stop <laughs> asking me." So I'm gonna grab this. I think what I'm gonna do is grab this, and this is the prosciutto. Yeah. Wow, man. You, this is what we just picked up fresh from the exactly. from the meat market on the yeah. way here. Look at that beautiful piece of meat. Oh no, it's. Bacon. It's, it's a bake. bacon. Bacon, right? And this is the prosciutto. Okay, so this is bacon. Bacon. That one's prosciutto. You know me and my American blood. <laughs> the bacon's winning. You gotta have the cheese, man. Right. And your right. guys' cheese here in Serbia is unreal, man. Very good cheese. <laughs> Especially cheese. I'm a mess, guys, but. You like it? Bam. 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 B-O-M-B. <laughs> B-O-M-B. I like this, man. No, do you want yogurt or milk? Coffee? Coffee? Mm-hmm. Sure. <laughs> yogurt or milk. <laughs> you have it. <laughs> I know. So we make coffee. You might on on a yogurt. Mekike is dangerous, yo. This shit's good. So good. This is so good. I've never had it before. But I think I like it even more because I know that Stanko's mom put a lot of love and hard effort into this right now this morning. She prepared this all for us and it looks like it took quite a bit of time. And it's only about 9 in the morning right now. So she's been up for a while preparing us this meal which is incredible. And well Stanko's mom doesn't speak too much English but we get along well. We've been having great conversations. Exactly. I, I talk to her. Stanko says a few words to her in Serbian. And we just we've been having great conversations getting along well. I love the whole energy and the vibe here. Every night we've come here, we've been feeling like very at home, very special. Sometimes leave a little, a little drunk. I'm not gonna lie, mm -hmm. but it's it's nice, you know. Thank you. Man. Sometimes you have a little bit too much rakia, right? <laughs> Sometimes. Is that a thing? Too much rakia? Yeah, it's a thing. It's happened. Yeah. It's happened when you grab the drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we also have an, a selection of ham, the prosciutto, and the bacon. Yeah. Large large variety of meat. Exactly. That's Serbian. And we bought it fresh on the way here. On the way here, Stanko jumped out of the car, was like, wait right here, I'll be back. Came in with this bag of meat. Mm. Bomb. Priyatno. 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 Like something like, please make yourself. Please okay. take it. Thank you, thank you. This is the um, older Kaimak. It's older. Older. 
It's uh, uh, overcooked. Okay. So this is um and and more. So Kaimak is essentially like a clotted cream, and it's very popular here in this region of Serbia. Well, it's a all around Serbia, everywhere. But in this region specifically, it's very popular because a lot of this Kaimak is made in Zlatibor, Coffee. which is actually where we're mm -hmm. heading today. And it arrives here cute. very, very fresh, okay, very soon. Okay, but as you can tell, here. this here is a here fresher Kaimak. And you can tell it's a lot more but fluffy, first, a lot more first, like first, whipped first, almost. First, then you have the more aged Kaimak over on this way. And it's a lot more harder, it, almost kind of like a a block of butter, just a whole, a different texture as a whole. I'm a fan of this super young Kaimak, but I just slapped some of the older one on this Mekike. Yeah. Let's try it. You can't go wrong with Kaimak, bro. Very nice. Dude, all the Kaimaks bomb. Let's go with the young one. Oh. <laughs> they put on Preskavica, you take big spoon, dude. Yeah. Big spoon ah, of Preskavica. Yeah, like and, it's it's mm -hmm. and it's melting, you know. And all your Preskavica with climb. Yeah, yeah. You Strong like it? food. Strong food. No, I just straight. Bro. Meat, meat. Kaima, kaima. I could eat this whole jar. It probably wouldn't be good for me, but... Man. <laughs> probably would finish that is nice, that. dude. <laughs> How long will one of these jars of Kaima last in the house? Serbian house. <laughs> Couple of days. <laughs> Couple of days? <laughs> Well, if you don't mind me asking, how much is like this much of fresh kaimak price. at a store? Yeah, price wise. I'm not sure. Mama, how much is this kilo kaimak? About uh, 800 dinners. I love kaimak. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. In the beginning, it was I didn't really like it so much when I first arrived in Serbia because I wasn't used to it. I had never had it before, really. But now I've grown really comfortable with it. And when I order something and it doesn't come with kaimak, I'm like. Can I get some Kaimak, please? <laughs> so, you know, I'm adapting, I'm adapting. It's just very sad that I'm almost leaving Serbia. The time has come. But I'm glad that I was able to spend the last few weeks doing things like this. Hanging out with Stanko. Yo, this is sick. Thank you so much. She just made us some awesome coffees. Yo, I feel so bad because we left a lot of food on the table, but... Stanko just told me, dude, we always buy like three times more than we need, so do not feel bad. This is yeah, this is pretty uh, typical. Because for every Serbian, uh, uh, hospitality of them is to uh, buy more food. Mouth it's shame too. if you uh, miss food on table. If you don't have enough. Yeah, if you don't have enough. Yeah, so yeah, it's yeah. better to have more. Better have more. You hear that, guys? You guys gotta live like Serbs wherever you're watching. If you're inviting people for over, make sure it's a feast because exactly. Stanko and his mom haven't disappointed. Every time we come here and eat, it's just so much food and it's all amazing, so good. His mom is such an incredible chef. And she has actually a book of recipes that were actually like all handwritten from her mom and passed down from generations and generations. And it's really, really cool. Eat the Mar saw it the other day and he's like, oh, a Serbian cookbook. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> Guys, I'm telling you, I could not make this up. What did you just get done yelling at me? What's coming out? Cake. His mom made us a homemade cake and I'm so full, but we got some coffee and I can't say no. Yeah, this is the cake. And as I mentioned, I'm completely stuffed right now. We have been, yeah, we have ate pretty good, pretty good today. And I'm usually not a big, I don't eat too much in the mornings, but um, yeah, right now, there was no way we could escape that feast. It was incredible, but now time to try some of this cake. I love any kind of cake or sweet with banana. Perfect, perfect, perfect combination. So we're actually about to be taking off from the house right now. Yesterday we stopped by a store and loaded up on a bunch of snacks for this epic road trip. Now, I really don't know how I'm gonna actually place these vlogs. I really wanna show you guys, um, yeah, this whole experience. So I don't know if I'm gonna post uh, me visiting a Serbian home video first or these Lati Bar vlog first. Not too sure, but either way, I'm super excited for today. I'm so excited to go visit Lati Bar finally. I've heard nothing but incredible things. Stanko, man. Thank you so much for inviting me into your house, man. You're right, I feel man. so at home here. I love it here. And I really hope we get to see each other again. If not here, then in Los Angeles. Definitely. And it's for sure happening. I mean, Serbia is like my second home now. I'm always going to be back. Anywhere in the world. Anywhere in the world, bro. Yeah. Anywhere. So thank you so much, bro. 
Thank you so much. Let me go give a hug to Mama. Mama, thank you so much for everything. You're welcome. I appreciate it. Thank you. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Bala.